Okay, let's have a talk about coolant in your system. If you have a Mercedes diesel engine like mine, OM651, Mercedes suggests that before and included April 2014, you plan to use the blue coolant. If you check on the Bevo specific, the sheet is the number 320. The specific for the blue one is the 325.0 and I suggest you consider using the Phoebe 24196. If you want to switch to the newer one, the pink colored uh, coolant, you all need to consider the specific 325.5.6 the Phoebe product is a 37400 and you need to consider the pink one if you have an engine that is newer than April 2014. Okay, before you can choose blue that is cheaper or pink after you need to use the pink one. And I let you know usually Mercedes suggests to change your coolant after 15 uh, years or 250,000 kilometers mine that you see here and is supposed to be blue but as you see it darker is black as only seven years and around 170,000 kilometers however a part of this as you see here is the phoebe pink stuff you can consider to use also a cleaner for the system. In particular, I suggest this one, that is the Liqui Moly, part number 20455, okay? And uh, you don't need one liter, as you see here. You usually, this is, this uh, one liter is enough for probably cleaning the cooling system of five or six cars, okay? And let's have a look together now on my car. Okay. Um, okay, as you see, you need to rise the car, you need to remove the panel, and then here you have the drain pipe. There is, as you see, a little plastic cover you undo rotating counterclockwise okay now it's completely open and then here you need to connect the pipe to a drain okay as you see here in my setting I'm using a tank which I have vacuumed so I can suck directly now there is only here Okay, escaping from the system and then in order to charge the system my plane is to consider to use something that I want to show you because it's very simple so this is your cup you can consider to buy a new cup okay and uh, to remove this part to make a hole connect something as you see here okay this is a brake um, oil cup okay this is an original mercedes cup for a brake reservoir and i connect the pipe in this way with these fittings that are high pressure higher fittings but in this case in my opinion we can arrange for something a little simple and as you see i consider the use of a common uh, metal shim and this is uh, around uh, four centimeters in the external uh, diameter okay and i put as you see a piece of uh, of pipe and i was able to find a grommet like this one or if you are not able to find something like that you can consider as you see here is sitting nicely here you can consider to use an o-ring or something like that 
However, it works in this way. You put your gasket here, sitting inside, okay? It's not moving inside the tank. Sorry, it's not moving, I told you, inside the tank, but as you see, probably you're going to lose it ah, in some difficult to reach places. Okay, it's over there. Here we are. Okay, come to me, come to me. He, 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 he. Okay, thank you. Okay, so keep in mind your gasket is the most difficult part of the entire job. So when you place this one and you apply vacuum on this pipe of the side of this uh, side of a pipe this became stuck in place so then you you can put a T or something as you want or simply you close the pipe in this way and you put inside the container in which you have your coolant okay so you can suck inside the system uh, without the necessity of purging air bubbles later so that is my suggest very simple and enjoy your uh, uh, your work on your car bye have a nice evening bye bye